Stan Gibalisco here, proprietor and operator of amateur radio station W1GV Whiskey One. Good vibrations. A viewer made a suggestion concerning my video about polarization diversity reception using three dipole antennas oriented up and down, east and west, and north and south. He suggested that instead of the two horizontal antennas, the two horizontal dipoles, that I use a large horizontal loop. Now a large horizontal loop is at least several wavelengths in circumference so that its polarization will be horizontal and it will be more or less omnidirectional. It will also offer a certain amount of diversity reception because of its sheer size in wavelengths. So it offers that advantage too. If you use a vertical antenna, which obviously is vertically polarized, it can be a vertical dipole or a ground plane antenna, any kind of vertical antenna uh, which offers vertical polarization, then all of the directions of horizontal polarization can be obtained with the horizontal loop and in addition some spatial diversity advantages will also be realized. Instead of only instead of you having to use three uh, receiver sections down to the detector now you only have to use two so in a sense this is like dual diversity reception except in terms of polarization it's uh, triple diversity reception. It offers spatial diversity and polarization diversity advantages. So that uh, was a very good suggestion my colleague made and I'd like to offer my version of that idea here for your contemplation, enlightenment, or disparagement depending upon your frame of mind. Stan Gibalisco signing off W1GV saying 73 and so long which regardless of the antenna type in my native fist shall now and forever after translate to da 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 da